Alright, yo, what's up, everybody? Uh, so, I decided to do another commentary this Wednesday, because uh, based on the last commentary, you guys really enjoyed that. So. Yeah, so the reason I'm playing Mirror's Edge right now instead of, like, Black Ops 3 or something is just because uh, it's one of the new backwards compatibility games on Xbox One, so I thought, hey, why not? I love this game. Never forget it, so, you know. So, the reason, like, uh, usually, like, I post a funny moments now or something, but, uh, I, I recorded some, the, some CSGO. Didn't really work out too well. Yeah, so I, I also recorded uh, Black Ops 3 a little bit, but nothing really good happened there either. And originally, we were gonna do, try to do the Easter egg tonight for uh, Shadows of Evil, but that plan kind of, you know, didn't work, so not gonna do that. Alright, so basically on the name of this video, you can probably already tell what it's about. Okay, that was kind of pointless, to be honest. Oh, okay. Probably gonna die now. Oh, wow. Wow. Alright, Grady, Grady's true on this. Anyway, but from the title of this video, you guys probably already know what this is about. I mean... Kind of self-explanatory. Now I'm not talking about, about getting like hit in the. Well, I guess I am kind of talking about getting hit and that's an accident. Like it sucks. Now I uh, I don't know about you girls. I mean it probably hurts when you get kicked, you know, there in the crotch area, too. But I've never experienced there. But the way it works for guys is like it, it's it's terrible. So whenever you get hit in the nuts, let's say you're playing football or something, having a good time, all of a sudden you throw the football. Someone throws the football. And you're trying to catch it, it slips through your hand a little bit, and boom, round the nutsack. Oh my god. This is literally the worst. Oh, okay. Okay, I got up with it. It is a literally the worst feeling in the world. At first, you can feel the impact. Like, you feel the impact of the ball or whatever hitting your your nuts. But after... Uh, you don't you don't really feel the pain until <laughs> a second or two after it's been done. After the damage has been done, you know? It, uh, it really doesn't start hurting, like I said, till like a second or two after. And then it's just this aching, nauseating, you know, just like pain. And you're just like, oh god. Jeez, that is so scary. Can you imagine that, dude? Oh my god. Yeah, it is, it's just this aching pain. You just wanna, you just wanna quit everything, dude. You just wanna go to bed. You just wanna be, you just wanna be done with life at that point, man. It's, it's just terrible. And that aching feeling just makes you just like want to like barf, dude. You just want to, you just want to quit. Like I, like I'm saying, you just want to be done. You just, you're just done after you. You're basically incapable of doing anything that requires you moving, you breathing, you thinking. Just you're, you're done. Okay. Now, I, I what I'm going to talk about today is the time I hit my nuts, not with playing with friends or anything or doing. Okay, that kind of sounded weird. Now that I think about it. Wow. Not while playing a sport or something, and then, you know, something accidentally hit. I'm talking about, like, getting hit with something hard, right? And so I actually remember this very clearly, because it was right when the first season of Walking Dead had just finished, and my, me and my dad had picked up the uh, Blu-ray, and we were watching the uh, the series together. Yeah, so uh, we, we were about halfway through, really, uh, watching the series, right? And so I had just gotten home from school, and I was waiting for my dad to come home, and we were going to get ready to watch it. And, you know, being a little genius, uh, my 3.6 GPA average that I have, you know, being me, my little genius self, I, uh, I was on the, the, the little, like, nightstand coffee table, and, uh, I was, I was just jumping around on it because, you know, I, I was that age, you know. I was being childish, just, you know, bouncing around, bouncing around, all of a sudden, I, I, my foot slips, my left foot slips, and I'm like, oh crap, I'm gonna fall, so I fell, and I, I didn't just hit my arm or anything, no, I hit my left nut, like, it hit the left side of the table, and oh my god, remember that aching pain where you feel, remember how I said you feel the impact, and then just that, and then you start feeling the pain, no, 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 that did not happen here, I immediately, immediately started feeling the pain, it was... One of the most atrocious things in my life, to be honest. Like it, like uh, right after I hit my nut, I was like, oh, ooh, ooh, and because I, I had literally thought I busted my nut, not in the good way either. Like I, had, like it literally just busted. I literally thought that. I was so afraid too. Yeah. So after I had ran into the bathroom checking my nuts, sack, I, I ran, I ran into my mom. And she was like, mom, mom, I, I think, I think I won't be able to have children. Like. E Whenever you get hit in nuts, for guys especially, you're wondering if you can have children. Like, you're afraid that, you know, they maybe come out, like, mess up or something, or if you just won't be able to have them in general. 
it, it, it is very scary to get hit in the nuts when you're a guy because you have to supply the babies and you don't know now if they're going to be messed up if, if something's like terrible now and your sperm is unusable it it's crazy but it, it's it's scary too yeah you, you just start wondering if everything will be okay and uh you know fortunately everything was okay but i did go to the doctor right and that was one of the most scariest things ever because uh, not only did a guy have to check my nutsack out but it was it was the fact that it could potentially, like, I could not use that nut and they would have to cut off that. That's literally what the doctor said. He said, oh, well, if he had hit it harder and it popped, or if, like, his nuts had popped, or if his ball popped, then, you know, uh, we couldn't, uh, we would have to surgically remove it. Do you know how scary that was for a, a freaking 11-year-old or whatever to hear those words come out of a doctor's mouth? your ball literally exploding into blood. I was terrified. I thought I was gonna die. Like, if I had to lose my left nut, I would literally say, all right, put the gun to my head, I'm done. Like, I, I could not live without my left nut. And I'm not, like, attracted to my left nut, you know? Like, I'm not like, oh, this is my favorite nut, you know, my thing. I don't really, like, have a favorite nut, but it's scary at any point that you can just, like, if you hit your balls hard enough that they can literally bust and can, I mean, can you honestly like, think about that for a second, guys? And I don't, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know the uh, the girl equivalent of it, but I bet it would hurt the same as much. So after we were done with the doctors, I had a guy, I got a doctor's note for you know uh, excuse in school and stuff like that. So you know that that was that was probably the best thing that came out of it. But then I, I couldn't go into recess because of my my nut in injury. Okay, so if you couldn't go into recess, you had to go into, like, the teacher's classroom or something for, like, an hour. Well, not, like, just for the all of recess. And, uh, yeah, I mean, it wasn't the funnest thing in the world. And, you know, I, I was a good kid in fifth grade, you know? I mean, I had, you know, uh, straight A's. I, that was the only year I got straight A's, because it was fifth grade, and I, I, I did pretty good that year. Just, you know, not to break. Yeah, so uh, one of the teachers knew me because I was bad, really bad at English. I used to be really bad at English, and I probably still am. I yeah, but uh, she she looked at me very strange when I had walked in there. Because usually only, like, bad kids go in there, you know, like, if, like, they did something bad, they can't go outside for recess, like, you know. And she looked at me, she was like, what are you doing in here with, like, the most, like, just the mean tone possible? And I was like, medical injury? Oh my god, that was the wow. Ooh, that was close. Oh, oh, no, I, ooh, wait, how am I in the elevator? What did I just, oh, I'm so done. Yeah, that kind of sucked, not being able to go outside of recess, because I remember, I remember that too, because I wasn't, the, when I wasn't out there, what had happened, this girl, uh, she was swinging on the swing set, and she jumped off, because, you know, that was like the cool thing to do in, uh, elementary school, if you jumped off the, uh, swing set while it was still high up in the girl had uh, jumped off the swing set, right, and broke her arm. So everyone got like 10 minutes more of recess because uh, they had to like, I don't know, they had to get her like medical help. You know, I, you know, I, I'm waiting for the day that happens again, to be honest, because the day that happens, dude, I, I may just retire on every part of every aspect of my life. I may just. Anyway, guys, if you did enjoy that video, you want to see another commentary of mine, because you apparently like my stories and stuff. I have a lot of them. That was just one of them. So if you want to see why my teacher got arrested, I'll leave an annotation of that at the end of the video. And if you want to see a new Fallout 4 video that I'm posting, you're kind of interested in, you know, walkthroughs, but they're only funny moments, you know, kind of... You know, it's kind of cool. Uh, I would check that out. Both of them will be in the outro that's about to come up, guys. So, yeah. And if you could, please like this video if, if you enjoyed it. And if you want to see more of my videos, more commentaries, more uh, walkthroughs and stuff like that, then uh, go ahead and click that subscribe button. And, uh, as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Let me go chase after this dude. Peace. What just happened? What was that? You got what the heck?
I am what? Okay, wow, okay. What is doing it again? What <laughs> what glitch is this?